Hi, I'm Charlotte, I'm here with Superdrug and I'm here to talk all about healthy snacks for mums and mums-to-be. Healthy snacks are really important when you're a new mum to make sure that you're getting plenty of energy and nutrients, so I'm going to introduce you to my three top snacks for you to include in your diet. My first recipe today is berry bowls. It's a really simple and easy recipe to put together. It's absolutely perfect for mums who are on the go all the time and need a quick, healthy and delicious boost of energy. The first ingredient I'm going to add to my bowl is some natural yogurt. All you need is just a handful of nuts or a sprinkle of seeds to add to your dish and it adds plenty of healthy proteins, which are absolutely brilliant for energy. Next, it's simply just adding in some blueberries and strawberries just because they look great in a berry bowl. Just stir them in nicely so that the ingredients all mix really well together. There is your berry bowl dish ready to eat. My next recipe is for overnight oats. Now this is probably the quickest breakfast you could make in the world. It's simple as putting the ingredients together, popping them in the fridge and then getting them out the next morning. When we're making overnight oats, you just need to put some oats into a bowl. Normally around about 30 or 40 grams of oats will do. Next, I am going to add about a handful of blueberries. Alongside that, I tend to add some raisins. I'm going to add some ground up flax seeds. It's just to make sure that the dish has got some healthy fats. Next, I'm gonna add a pinch of cinnamon to the bowl. You can add really as much cinnamon or as little cinnamon as you like to taste. The last ingredient that we're going to add is some milk, so whatever your milk of choice is absolutely fine. And just fill the milk so it goes just over the oats in the bowl. Once you've done that, pop it in the fridge and it should be ready for you first thing in the morning. So today I'm going to be showing you a recipe for a smoothie that doesn't just include fruits and vegetables. We're gonna make sure we include a variety so that we've got some calcium from the milk and some protein from foods like nuts and seeds included in the smoothie to make sure it's nice and varied. So the first ingredient in my fruit and vegetable smoothie is going to be a couple of handfuls of frozen berries. The reason that I use frozen berries is simply because they are really cheap and easy to buy. So the next ingredient is just two or three splashes of milk, one medium banana, just to add an extra portion of your five a day. Kale's really great because it's full of nutrients, but you can use any leafy greens that you want. One large teaspoon of peanut butter. That just helps to make sure that there's plenty of protein as well in the smoothie recipe. The last ingredient that we're going to add is some flax seeds. Thank you so much for watching, really hope you enjoyed the video. Please do give us a thumbs up and make sure you leave any comments below and do subscribe to Superdrug Loves for more videos just like this. Bye.